Welcome, air sign. If you are an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libran, this is your full moon for the month of November. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful like, shares, and support. Ladies and gentlemen, um, um, please remember if you would like to see the extended of this reading, you have to become a member of the channel. Use the blue button in order to um, uh, connect to the channel. I want to say to each and every person, thank you. This is the full moon of November 2020. It is for the Aquarian, Geminis and Libran. First, we look at the general energies. Then we are going to be looking at the individual sun sign people and moon sign people. We go clockwise with this reading. I want to say thank you to each and every person. Please share this video. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up so that it can be picked up in the Alba, Alba rhythm. I am doing um, year readings, um, 2020 year readings. Um, and, um, uh, use the 15% in order to see, um, all the 2020 year reading. Ladies and gentlemen, honestly, in order to give out, uh, uh, gifts and money that you don't have, it's better to buy yourself a reading because at least you're investing in your own self. Okay. So Aquarians, Geminis and Liberans, um, I would like to say how much I appreciate, um, your blessings, um, on the channel thank you so much be open up to the energy and be awakened and understand that only love is real um if you are a moon sign person you can skip the sun sign reading after the general and then go straight into your own reading so first we're going to be doing the general reading i will tell you when we're changing um and moving forward so Full moon are always four weeks. Um, full moon is actually six weeks, but we do the full moon in four weeks energies in order for you guys to be um, realized that after the full moon. So the first week of the full moon. So the full moon is on the 15th. So the week of the 15th, the beginning of the week of the 15th, because the full moon is in this week and then four weeks later, that is your full moon energies. So you work it with the reading of... Uh, uh november going in december okay so um when we look at the ending you're going to be ending um the two last week of november the two first week of december in this full moon because it's number 15 of the month so um air sign people air elements let's look and see what is transpiring so i see you have no regret with a situation you have absolutely no re regret with a situation and um, the energy of, uh, um, you know, trying to, um, you know, regain your strength is going to be the energy of this full moon. So what you see for the energy, um, a lot of you are going to try to regain some sort of a strength dealing with some situation that was transpiring. OK, so that is transpiring. And some of you were looking for some uh, good news air sign people, but it's not going to be like manifesting until in December. So. Uh, then we see you men, um, 45 years and older are going to be receiving some sort of a news and that is going to be, um, good. So whatever is transpiring, a lot of you men, 45 years and older was worried, but the news is going to be coming in. Um, a whole lot of, uh, worries is going to be over. Some of you were dealing with a fire sign um, person, but this worries is now going to be over. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, I see the worries is now going to be over. Our offer is going to be coming in for you, and I see the hardship that some of you here sign people were going through is going to be over. A lot of you, a, a fire sign person was creating a whole lot of issues for you, and you have no regret that you bring the situation to an end. Men 45 years and older, some sort of information is going to be coming out about a fire sign person that is going to give you an offer. Um, so it's as if a fire sign person, if you had and was dealing with a boss or a fire sign person, this woman is 45 years and older. Some of you men, it could be your wife. So some sort of information is going to be coming out. I see some sort of investigation and some sort of information is going to be coming out. And I see some of you are going to be receiving a new story from a fire sign person. Then I see regrets. Uh, no. 
you don't regret a situation the worries is now over and you're out of the hardship so a lot of you air sign whatever that was happening and transpiring you don't regret a situation for a moment you do not regret whatever was happening and transpiring you do not regret and uh, you're getting out of a situation and you're leaving a situation behind so let's see what was transpiring I see a lot of you, a lot of you air sign was praying and hoping to resolve a resolution to come for a situation, some sort of a situation um, that you were dealing with, some sort of an emotional uh, situation is going to be resolved. And this is going to be good in the first week. In the second week, men 45 years and older, I see you receive some sort of a news from a new lover or it could be a child contacting you. So that is going to be good. Some of you have been waiting for this news and it's going to be good. Then um, some of you are going to be receiving a letter and this letter um, is going to be showing up and you are going to be realizing that your worries is going to be over. So some sort of information is going to be coming in that is going to be letting you know that your worries is over and this is good. An offer is going to be offered to you men 50 years and older. So you um, men, um, I think this is 45 years and older, is going to be receiving an offer. So expect some sort of a management position is going to be opening up for you men. I see an offer is going to be offered to you. And I see definitely an offer is going to be offered to you. And I see um, you're going to be overcoming whatever the issue is and whatever the situation that was playing okay so so this is um really like um some sort of an issue um that was transpiring is working out for you guys so so i see um justice um is here for a whole lot of you some sort of a balancing out uh, that is going to be happening and um transpiring okay and if you were having legal issues, I see some of you are no longer worried over these legal issues. Okay. Um, some of you, whatever it was transpired, I see, um, a lot of you overcome a situation with a Leo. Um, um, it is about, um, some sort of a news. Some of you could be waiting on some sort of a news, um, that was supposed to happen. And you're going to be, um, realizing that you overcome a situation that a Leo had created some issues for. So if you notice this, you're coming in this full moon, not having powers coming in this full moon. But as you leave this full moon, um, if you notice all of this energy is positive. So you are overcoming some sort of a situation that a Leo that had created for some of you. And by overcoming the situation, you're coming out victorious. But this Leo, they're finding out what this Leo has done. So good news is going to be coming in to a lot of you ear sign about a Leo and some sort of a deceptiveness that this Leo had created and truths is going to be coming out. So it is going to be powerful because a lot of you were powerless in a situation and now um, it's as if uh, um, you, you communicate what was happening, show up people for who they are. And it's as if you're saying, I really don't care. You men, um, you were open for some new messages. It's going to be coming in the last week of November, which is good. Um, the third week, the first week of December, some sort of a news is going to be coming in where you find out that your worries about this fire sign person is going to be over. Whoever this fire sign person is, is over. And uh, I see a lot of you men is going to be getting some sort of a promotion. The worries is going to be over. Okay. Ooh. Oh. The worries is definitely um, going to be over. So there was some sort of a um, play, deceptive play that has been happening and transpiring. And people are going to be finding out the truth of what was happening and transpiring. Okay. So, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to be looking at the sun sign people. So what's happening for the sun sign people? Because you were dealing with a situation um, with a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion person between the age of 18 and 45. So you sun sign people were dealing with this person and you had to find inner strength to, um, is this a child? Is this your partner? Who is this person? Is it a sister? Is it a brother? You were, you sun sign people were having some sort of an issue 
um, with this person. This person is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion. Who was this person? What was this person doing? Because whatever this person was doing, I see truth is coming out. And because of that, it could be a partner. It could be someone you were in a relationship with. And they're going to be finding out what this person have been doing. The energy of the Four of Cups, you have no regrets. Um, a cycle is coming to an end. So whoever this scorpion is, is it a, your child? Is it, um, a karmatic situation? Um, some of you are dealing with a scorpion and I see a cycle is coming to an end and you have no regrets because it's as if you have been clearing karmas with this person. I see a whole lot of you was praying to get out of a relationship with a, a scorpion or praying to get out of a relationship with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person. And this full moon is going to be releasing you out of this relationship. Whoever this person is and whatever this person have done, I see that you're going to be released because a lot of you were like, I got to get out of the situation. This is not healthy. I'm now seeing what people were saying about the situation and this person. Um, so I see a new start is going to be coming up for you ear sign people who were dealing with some sort of a situation, whether this person was um, a family member or a boss or a friend, you had lost your strength dealing with the situation. And I see you're finally getting out and a new start is going to be coming in. You have no regret that a cycle is now over with this person. No regrets. As we look at the men 45 years and older, I see... Some sort of money is going to be coming in to you. Some of you men, uh, your child is going to be helping you out financially. Some of you men, a young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person is going to be helping you out financially. Some sort of a money is going to be returned and this is going to be good. Then in the third week, what we sell, we sell the energy of the King of Pentacles. Um, a lot of you were worried about a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man. This man could be your father. And some of you, this man could be your father. Some of you, this man could be your boss. But this man was creating a whole lot of worries for you. This worries is now over. And I see that they are going to be letting you know this. And this could be a boss. This person is going to be fired. And some of you are going to be regaining their position. Um, This could be a father figure. You're going to be, you were worried. You haven't heard from this person. You're going to be receiving some sort of a message. Um. Whoever this person is and however this person is coming up is a businessman, a very deceptive businessman that has created some issue. And I see truth is coming out about this person. Now, some of you men who have a child that is a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn person, I see um, a lot of you um, could be healing a situation. Some of you had a child with love with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, and I see you're going to be healing the situation, and I see this person is going to be coming back and healing. So it's as if you haven't spoken to this child for a while, you haven't supported this child, and I see you're going to be coming back and healing some sort of a situation that is transpiring, okay? So wonderful alignments of energy, what is happening and transpiring. I see truth is going to be coming out. Whoever was dealing with a businessman, um, a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn businessman, I see they're going to be finding out a whole lot of lies about this person. Your worries is going to be over. Transition is coming up and an offer is going to be coming in, whatever that was transpiring and happening. A transition is definitely coming up. So some of you were hoping for some sort of a new job, some sort of a hoping. This is going to be happening for you. It is going to be a positive alignment of energy. So hold on to what you're going to be receiving. Take it, whatever the offer is, a business offer that is coming up. It is a yes. It is in the right direction. So a lot of you um, are going to be releasing relationships. A lot of you are going to be reconnecting with your kids and your kids are going to be helping you out or you're going to be reconnecting with your father and your father is going to be helping you out. Money is going to be coming in. I see some of you men are want to return to an old love. This person is a young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn because you realize you're going to be receiving some sort of a message from this person offering you love. Okay. Um, some sort of a news is going to be coming in in the third, the first week of December, and this is going to be good. So hold on tight. It is going to be powerful. Um, use the energies, understand what is transformed because it's going to be very powerful. I see a whole lot of changes is going to be coming up and a whole lot of uh, 
offers transition new offers are coming in especially um for people between the age of 18 and 45 you're going to be um you know climbing the ladder and being um manifesting over um other people and this is going to be extremely good so people between the ages of say 35 um 50 is going to be a good full moon for you guys so so um please remember to like and share come back and listen uh if you would like to see the extended because it shows up the astro clock of your 12 houses you can use the 499 in order to get over 499 per month um to get over to the extended you as will see everything from the the beginning of the year okay all right so we're moving forward to the moon sign people people who were born between the hours of uh, 6 p.m and 6 a.m some good news is coming in the lies is the uh, people are seeing the truth um the lies that was created around you people are now seeing the truth the lies of a leo um a lot of you are uh, victoriously overcoming some sort of a deceptive play that a leo has created a whole lot of um, people are finding out the truth of a Leo businessman or a Leo man and the lies and deceptiveness of this Leo man and truth is being revealed. Truth is being revealed and people are realizing and you're victoriously overcoming the deceptiveness of a Leo man. Some of you, you could have been in a relationship with this person or some of you, this person was a business person. However, it is coming up, you're overcoming and you're getting out of the hardship that you were dealing with, with a death deceptive businessman, whether a, um, or it could be a deceptive Leo man, it could be a deceptive boss, whoever this person is and whatever that was transpiring. A whole lot of you, air sign is going to be having a new start. You're going to be coming out of the hopeless situation that some of you were in. Some of you had got caught up in some sort of a hopeless situation. And now you're going to be getting out of that hopeless situation and regaining balance in your life. And it's going to be understanding that the hardship is now over and you're going to be receiving a new start. So this is going to be powerful. I see an organization, institution have seen the truth about an um, Aries Lee or Sagittarius woman for, uh, for 45 years and older. And I see a corporation institution is going to be um, advising you um, of something about this lady now. Um, some of you could be um, uh, getting divorced from this woman. Some of you are getting divorced from this woman. Some of you could be receiving some sort of a, um, a letter from this woman. So I see a corporation institution is going to be... Um, um 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 sending out so it could be that some of you this is um a woman that you are going to be because i see the letter is coming in and it could be a fire sign person in a corporation institution some sort of a letter is coming in um from this fire sign woman or um you are sending out a letter to this fire sign woman so whoever this person is and whatever this letter is all about a corporation institution a government corporation institution saw some sort of a deceptive play what this fire sign woman have gone and i see they're going to be showing this woman up then i see news some of you are going to be receiving some sort of a news from a aries leo or sagittarius person a young person whoever this person is I see this person is going to be reconnecting with you, air sign people. Um, some of you, this could be an old love is going to be returning. So you're going to be receiving some sort of a news from this person. It could be a, your child, but it's coming up as a lover. So it could be an old um, flame. This person is an Aries Leo Sagittarius. And I see some sort of a news is coming in about this person or from this person. So be aware that an ex-lover could be returning in your life. Then we see a tower moment came down um, for a fire sign person. They're finding out the truth of who this fire sign person is. So truth came out about this fire sign person and a tower moment came down. So if you notice, it's like an... Um, um, some of you air sign people are getting a new start because they realize that a young fire sign person had lied. And you can see that this person is between the ages of 18 and 45. And it's as if you 
you are connected to this person however it is you are definitely connected to this person and what is happening and transpiring is that they're finding out that this person had created a whole lot of issue for you ear sign people so it's a young some sort of a news for some of you it is an ex-lover is coming in for some of you you're going to be finding out that a young fire sign person has a done a horrific situation and i see you you stood up against this fire sign person and speak up and i see a tower moment a corporation is going to be sending an old woman a letter about their child so it could be you guys realizing and investigating um what a fire sign woman in a corporation institution has done they're going to be finding out that a fire sign woman in a corporation institution is the one that has uh, um copy some sort of a document and gave to a um an, a young fire sign person and their lovers and i see a tower moment is coming down so you you ear sign people you um moon ear sign people is investigating a fire sign in a corporation and finding out that a fire sign woman 45 years and older was the one who copied information and gave it to the a, a young fire sign person and their lovers and i see a huge tower moment is coming down and they found out what has happened and what has transpired and i see the truth um is here and the truth is coming out so here sign people i see you took down a situation you showed up people for who they are you understand what was happening and transpire truths came out and, and they found out that is an aries or a sagittarian person um in a corporate institution had given the lover and this young fire sign person some documentation and i see a tower moment came down on this person and truth is going to be revealed so air sign people please um share these videos i love you guys um go and check out the extended extended is uh, is individual where you see your six houses and what is happening and what is transpiring so please use the extended and check out the reading in order to see what is coming up and what is transpiring. I gotta go. Namaste. Have a wonderful full moon.